Hello everybody, my name's Erica and welcome to my channel or welcome back if you're continuing watcher or subscriber in take three of starting this video because the last take, I totally forgot to uh, change my screen around. Hello and welcome to another Rags to Riches or I, sh I shouldn't say another, but part two of Rags to Riches. Sorry, I am very chaotic for this video because I realized I needed to film this video because <laughs> I had not filmed it yet. But we are here, and we are back with another Rags to Riches. And I don't remember a whole lot of this Rags to Riches. Thanks to the second part when I tried to record this, I do remember a little bit. But you know what? Enough of my rambling for this beginning of this video. Let's just get into the game. All right, so we are in the game with our... Oop! Wrong screen. Uh, with our Sim, which is Fernando Rico. And I think I explained this before in a couple of other videos, but I always randomize their names, so sometimes they don't make sense, and I just think, whatever, I just go with it. Or unless I have, like, a specific name in mind for the sim, I just randomize the name. So we got Fernando Rico, who, um, kind of recapping, it pretty much came here with just his clothes. He had in mind that he wanted to pursue being a well-known farmer, and that was pretty much it. He decided to take the the plunge and leave home and he is literally starting from scratch so we were able to buy in the last part um a place for him to go to the bathroom a place to sleep and an overhang because i realized how you know rags to riches is probably the most difficult challenge and one trying to raise money and two trying to keep your sim alive uh because i've seen so many people's like characters die um because of not getting needs met dying of like something to related to the heat because if you don't have a home to help kind of reduce the heat on the sim during the summer they can die of like combustion or just overheating or in the winter where they literally freeze into like a blue ice cube so yeah and my goal is to definitely have a house where we can have some form of warmth before winter before winter but currently i don't know what oh we do have some a daisy we have blueberry and we do have a lemon and i wanted to plant these because one of the i feel like one of the faster somewhat faster ways of raising getting money is planting but i have no idea if these are even in season we'll have to see i don't think the lemon is in season but we'll just go ahead and maybe select a spot like over here to plant them We'll put the flower over here. We'll just go ahead and plant these real fast. Like the speed of light. Let's go to the Humor and Hijinks Festival and check out the fireworks. I hear they have the best fireworks show in town. Yeah, no, we're busy. So our sim has met some locals, so um, met Dylan, Deja, Corey, and Sarah. I mean, Sarah's technically the tavern worker, I guess the tavern or pub worker in town, so. But it looks like we need to get to sleep, so what I might do is fast forward a little bit to the next sims day just to get needs up a little bit. All right, so we are up. It is pretty much five in the morning Sims time, and we're eating some eggs and toast. I know that we need to kind of stop buying food, but it's like the quickest and like easiest thing. And I guess we could talk to this person because we do need to get our social. So our characteristics. So the aspiration I have is country caretaker. Um, so we definitely so visit Fenwick old Fenwick old New Hedford and the and the Bramblewood neighborhoods in Hedford on Bagley, which we have visited most, all three of them. Purchase one garden patch for your home lot, which we can't do that yet because it's cost money. Socialize with a fox, rabbit, or bird five times. We can do that. And then purchase a couch or a llama on your home lot. Of course, that costs money. But I didn't really actually like go through. So we have a nice cooking. We have fishing and gardening started go through what his characteristics 
characteristics are. So I did perfectionist, green friend, and animal enthusiast, and collector. I'm not 100% sure if I did the story. No, I did not do the story one with him because then I would have had a chance of getting a job. So but that's kind of like an introduction to a little bit of our sim. And of course he is, I think, a young adult. If I remember right. Yeah, he should be a young adult. Where do I check that? I forgot. I forgot already. Yeah, he's a young adult. I don't know how many... I don't remember how many days I set this to. But whatever. All right, he does need to, like, kind of clean himself up a little bit. So let's wash our hands a couple of times. Maybe. If you hurry up and, like, get up there. Now, I'm trying to figure out the quickest way to, like, make money. Really isn't, like, a really quick way to do it. Other than, like, fishing or, I guess, marrying. But I feel like that's against the rules. I really think that's against the rules. So let's go ahead and go fishing. Again. I'll speed through this. Okay, so, uh, so far, because we fast forward through a whole lot, um, Fernando has caught a goldfish, which is worth $7. We've gotten, um, an upgrade plumbing part, trout, perch, a voodoo doll, minnows, um, we also got earbuds, a couple of other minnows, um, which we haven't caught before, so that's been added to our notebook, another trout, um, caught a lump of clay, and we've also reached level four of fishing, and we also uh, caught a bass, which we haven't before. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this real quick, and we're going to go ahead and sell these, besides the minnows, because the minnows we can use to catch bigger fish. So we're going to keep the minnows, but we're going to sell the perch. Bass. 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 The trout. The goldfish, because there's no reason why we need to keep that. How much are the voodoo? Oh! Do you guys are seeing that? $1,900! We need to find some more voodoo dolls! <laughs> oh my god, guys! <laughs> okay, so, and a lump of clay, which is 150 which we don't need that. And then the plumbing part, which is only 30 Can we sell these? No, we can't sell them, can we? Crap. But oh my gosh, guys, $2,197. That can at least get us started farming. Oh my goodness. Yes, 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 yes. We need to go home. We need to go home right now. Like, right now. Well, we are back, and I did not invite her. Okay, well, she disappeared anyways. Okay, so let's go ahead and go into build mode, since we've got at least $2,000. And we're going to get rid of some of these rocks here, because we don't need them. And of course, we're getting money back for that. I think we should get rid of some of this, because where the house is going to be, we're probably not going to need it over there. Okay, so that brings us up to $2,557. Um, we do want to get started on farming. Oh, and these are only 10 bucks. That's cool. Okay. However, how much are the seeds going to be? That's, that's the real question. Um, boop. This could at least get us started because then we can do two of each. Oh, 
of the big plants. And then maybe start putting in some garden patches. These are also only $10. Cool. Cool. Um, I almost want to go to the farmer's market for 200 Yeah. Screw that. And maybe we should, I feel like we should have a fence. So just in case if the bunny rabbits or something try to get into it. Um, maybe we could do a little bit of this. And then we could do a little bit. Or maybe we could do it. Okay. Now let's go ahead. Okay, nice. Um, I think I can, actually I can purchase seeds from here. So let's go ahead and purchase two of each. Uh, not bad. Um, and then we'll go ahead and plant them. So I'm going to fast forward through this real quick. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and purchase some of the seeds here. Um, because sometimes I feel like I just get a better selection and then just chancing it. Let's go ahead and buy some here. Ooh, this is exciting because those two voodoo dolls coming out to almost $2,000, that was awesome. Like, I was not expecting that. Um, do a bell pepper. We got blueberries, so why don't we go ahead and do some blackberries. Do some carrots. Hopefully we don't rack up too much bill here. Maybe some green peas. I have lemon. Hmm. Onion. Parsley. Raspberry. Maybe some spinach. Maybe some strawberry. Okay, that sounds good. And we'll go over here. Oh, my game's being really laggy. I really need to clear out some hard drive space. That would probably help me a little bit. Um, and we don't have basil. Now, I would love to get into some flowers because these are expensive. I might buy a couple of flowers. Hmm. Hmm. Do grape, do holly, do lily, do potato, mm, should I do that? No, let's wait on that one. Do soy, because we can make that into soy wax. I think that's what, how we'll do it okay and that leaves us with like seven hundred dollars so that's like perfect but anyways back to the farm all right so let's go ahead and walk over here and plant them and that's probably gonna get smelly after a while not gonna lie okay so let's go ahead and plant basil plant Parsley, plant sage, and maybe we'll plant the other basil in there too. So let's just speed right through this. Lickety split. And we also, oh, we're gonna have to water all of this too. Crap. I didn't think of that. I didn't think that far. Um, carrot. 
Wait, my, I was about to say, where's my screen? Oh, not you. Um, plant. Let's do with onion and potato. Feed right along through this. Are you broken? Oh, it's probably because you don't have a top to be. Oh, well, you can like hold your horses for like two seconds. Or however long this is going to be. Good oh, plant. Um, and then soybeans. Oh, you're not doing that. You also need to eat again. Whoopsie. Um, and that is it. So let's go ahead and plant strawberry. We'll plant grapes here as well. I don't want to keep our other berries maybe with the other berries. But we do need to water what we've had so far. So I'm going to go ahead and fast forward through this. All right. So we got everything planted except for the flowers, cherry, and choco berry. Because I may put them over here with the flowers since they're... I think they're supposed to be more of a bush type flower anyways and it looks like we do need to go to the bathroom however i'm wondering if we have enough money to do this hoping we do and i do need to put in my cheats real quick Okay, um, showers. We do, but we need a wall. Oh, but we have this one. Okay, we'll go with this. That we can finally take showers on our property. <laughs> okay. We're just gonna go ahead and fertilize that so we can go to the bathroom. And then I think I'm going to go ahead and fast forward to the next Sims day. All right, so it is the next Sims day, and currently we actually have a plant for harvest. It was only our parsley plant, but we harvested six at $2 each, so we have raised $12. That's awesome, and of course we need to spray for bugs. Which, I cannot wait when we get animals, because then we get fertilizer. Also, it is lottery day, so I think it would be a good idea to purchase a lottery ticket. <laughs> so, after we get done spraying for bugs, I think he should purchase a lottery ticket. But why do I purchase it? That's a problem. Hmm... Oh, dang. I have to go somewhere to order it. Technically, my thing is off the grid. Hmm. We just, like, travel to a neighbor. Over here. We just go over here. Haha, <laughs> we can. All right, so it's only a hundred dollars. Let's go ahead and purchase it. What are the odds that we actually do win? But you know, it doesn't hurt to try, right? So we purchased the lottery ticket and we fulfilled our lottery day. We do need to plant the choco berry and the cherry, which this one is my lemon tree 
and my blueberry. Probably put the cherry over here along with the choco berry maybe over here. Go ahead and plant these real quick. Make him run all the way over here. No, look at him jog. And then what are all What is this over here? That's a daisy bush. I guess we can plant our flowers now. You need to get one of those. Uh... Oh, I kind of did not plant the right order. Whatever. Go ahead and plant. There we go. Okay, so I think, hmm, can we purchase one of those uh, gardening tables? Don't think so. Oh my goodness, we can, but that'll take all of our money. Oh well. We gotta make, we gotta spend a little to make, make money, right? Okay, so we can make flower arrangements out of our flowers now, whenever they bloom. Um, which I never did check to see when these actually... Okay, season summer. Oh, that's winter. Fall and winter. Summer and fall. So I got a season to wait yet. Except for daisies. Okay, so I guess we're going to go fishing for the day. Maybe we'll look out and get voodoo dolls again. Who knows? All right, so our fishing today, let me pause this real quick. It's, I guess, ghost hour at the local tavern. So we did get a lump of clay. Oh, afterlife can be tough. Come tell the local bartender all about it. Enjoy some uh, discounted libations. It's ghost night. We got a perch, another perch. We did get an upgraded uh, electronic upgrade part. Um, goldfish, another minnow, bass. Salmon, and we reached level five. So Fernando is developing the mental fortitude and patience required to be a great fisherman. Fernando now can fish in any weather and can fish even while being a little uncomfortable, tense, or stressed. Fernando can now catch a butterfly fish. Eh, interesting. So we're going to go ahead. So I tried the minnows, but the minnows really didn't do anything. So I might just go ahead and sell them. We'll go ahead, sell these items. Fish, I should say. They're not items. <laughs> Whoopsie. Perch. Another ball of clay. And how much? Ooh, 120 for this upgrade part. Because we don't really need them right now, so... But... Yeah, it's 11.15pm. Uh, we have $405. Which I'm hoping slowly we can get up to a grill. So that we don't have to worry about, like, eating here all the time. Because, for some reason, the bartender wasn't even at the bar, so we had to cook stuff off of that. It's definitely interesting. And he's getting a social need up, but I don't know how much it's getting up. Uh, we definitely... How are we doing a friendly introduction to him when he came up and talked to us? Uh, maybe we'll do a friendly introduction to her... And they're just, is it a her? Oh, it's a guy. Whoopsie. Is unemployed. His name is Sn Seth Snow. You seem the, f the friendly sort, you know. If you want to help out and a few of the important local villagers are often in need of hand, just walk up and offer help. 
I mean, we could do that, but it's sometimes kind of hard, especially depending on the help that they need. You may have to purchase it if you don't have, like, said animal or said thing, and you can't obtain it without buying it. So, uh, I don't know. But, yeah. But I, I think I'm going to leave it off here. All right, everybody, I'm going to leave it off there. Um, you know, some exciting things happen there. We're out of nowhere. Voodoo dolls get you like $1,900 for two of them. So that was really cool. Um, but thank you so much for watching. If you do want to stick around for this Rags to Riches or the other Let's Plays that I'm doing, I am doing a Decade Challenge Let's Play, uh, Eco Style Living Let's Play, just to understand and play more of some of our game packs and expansion packs that we have. And I am also... I do builds now, um, kind of getting into that, and I may be adding a new one in there, dealing with scenarios. So if you want to stick around for those, please hit the subscribe button and that bell, uh, bell notification. I do post every uh, Sims content under Ginger Snaps Gaming every Friday, and fun bookish content if you want to check it out under Ginger Books on Mondays. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and for sticking with me with my chaotic schedule, because I kind of got derailed a little bit this month, but hopefully we're back on track. But thank you so much for watching. I hope, I hope everybody has a great start to their weekend, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!